This is the driveway here into what was the original Bell State Hospital and uh, I started working here when I was 17 and a half years old as a mental health nurse. It was very, very different then. The, in those days we had almost 1,300 patients in this hospital and coming to work here was like working, becoming part of a really huge family. Sometimes a great family, sometimes a wee bit dysfunctional. And over the years, things changed very, very much um, for patients and for staff here. So we moved from that huge hospital um, down to care in the community. And a big part of my job in my life was um, supporting patients uh, to rehabilitate and go back into the community. I was appointed um, to my first ward sisters post when I was 21 years old and um, I was always getting in trouble then and, and uh, complaining about everything, wanting to change everything. So I think they gave me a ward sisters post to kind of give me authority and uh, keep me a bit quiet. There was a lot of fun in those days in the nurses' homes as a young student nurse and you know, um, also a lot of restrictions on us, but um, so for instance, you, you were never ever allowed boys in your room and any visitors had to be left the nurses' home by 10 o'clock at night and the doors were locked at 11 and if you arrived after 11, you were recorded in the late book and reported to the matron. So I was in front of the matron several times as a student nurse for being out too late and having friends in my room and all, all sorts, so lots of stuff like that. But things that we look back on now and think, oh, you know, how different was it then? I moved into organisational development mainly as it was a journey between um, developing and educating nurses into becoming interested in developing teams in the organisation. A lot of the experience and training and skills that I had as a mental health nurse in terms of understanding how people behave and why they do things that they do has really equipped me quite well um, for organisational development in so many ways. Mental health nursing um, has always had a bit of a reputation for being quite assertive or Bolshe, depending from where you're standing around it. And I think that particular asset and aspect of my personality has equipped me really well for organisational development because now I'm paid to ask the difficult questions, whereas before um, that just came naturally to me.